Hi, welcome to my channel. In this video, I will share it to you. It's about project named Capsis. Um, this project requires following software. Just visit my YouTube channel, and you will see four install videos. Okay. So first is you need to install Java 17 or JDK 17 and Apache NetBeans 14. Then the second one is you need to install uh, Apache Maven. Then the third one is you need to install MySQL 8.0 and MySQL Workbench 8.0 as a tool. Then the fourth one is you if you want to view my uh, Jasper file, okay. So just install Jasper Soap Studio um, 6.19.1 and then okay proceed to java project capsis um after you download and then after you install uh you cannot run this if you cannot uh, add the database capsis so inside of this uh, folder capsis uh you will see uh sql file this is a type of file this one new project 2022 um, 08, 09, 21, 40. So this uh, file, um, this is a SQL file, which is a database of uh, Capsis. So after you install my SQL and my SQL workbench, then you can uh, copy this uh, script. Then you can execute the file. So right click this file then okay if you install successfully the uh, MySQL workbench then you can if you right click this then you can open then it will proceed to my SQL workbench so if you will notice this this script is unconnected if you will see the tab here so if it is unconnected you cannot uh, uh, run the script because the this button execute uh, script or query cannot be enabled so able you to enable this uh, back click this uh, house uh, icon or home icon then click this local instant mysql 0 click that one then enter uh, password then after you enter your password then click this unconnected tab then copy the script then click the local instance mysql 0 tab then click this um, text then paste the script okay so that's it then if you will notice if you uh, control a highlight all the script then you can execute the query okay click this icon because this is a uh, uh, enable button so you can execute all the queries so after you execute the queries you will add a uh, capsis in your um, database capsis this is the database of um, Capsis project. So proceed to your um, Capsis project, then right click, then click run. If you you can uh, you will see login form. Then here um, click this one then user select row then if you will notice you have two accounts here two user um, admin and cashier then the password then the photo blob so this is the password which is encrypted so this is the username then the password okay so try to log in invalid account so because we don't know the password so the default password is admin then click login 
okay um this is the after you login this is the main menu um main form of capsis project so this is uh capsis pos so if you click this food uh categories uh there's no menu here so for example if you click this dessert so there's no menu show so able you to do that uh, click this uh, administration then click this menu of the day then click okay click this one okay it's manual um, I don't uh, add checkbox here to check all the menu because uh, we need to add uh, manually okay so click this um, button to save the menu because this this menu is available for today so menu of the day just click this yes button then menu of the day is successfully added okay so if you click this dessert there's a menu available for today so this is available if you click the drinks the there's a six then rice then soup then bayan so if you add um click this button there's a uh, name of the menu then the blue e, uh, blue foreground is the price if you click its uh, button uh, it will add it to table then if you click this again then the quantity is uh, added by one okay click then if you want to edit this uh, row or quantity you need to or you want to um, minus one the quantity then click this minus then click if you want to add um, 20 quantities just edit then type 20 then enter then it will um, edit 20 so the, the total is 2000 830 so uh, let's uh, new or if we hold this then if we click then if we release then this uh, file will be erased then uh, release okay this is a uh, previous order then if we add uh, food categories let's uh, add here categories then if we add um, the example uh, for lunch lunch package then this is description is package okay save yes okay um, Okay, we have added lunch. No, th this is a uh, wrong spelling. Uh, lunch. Okay. So uh, we have added uh, food categories, which is lunch, which is this is the package of food categories. So let's uh, log out. Uh, exit this program then let's run again oh no uh, because we don't add menu uh, the, la um, the lunch will not added here so next is you need to add menu for lunch so click this new then add lunch or breakfast here um okay so here is we need to add breakfast for example 
So let's assume breakfast. There's a lunch, but uh, we need to select a uh, breakfast. Uh, breakfast. So here, uh, menu is um, what is our example here? Let's uh, uh, add photo um, to pictures. Okay. Then menu breakfast. No. Okay. Then the um, egg with egg egg with um, with um, with um, tapa. Okay. Add with tapa, then the price is um one um thirty five. So this is uh tapa beef. Okay, then save. So we have added breakfast here. Then able you to add this. Uh, breakfast in the menu need to add menu of the day then check this breakfast with egg with tapa then add yes because uh, okay there's a breakfast here available then if we click he this uh, button there's a package is uh, egg with tapa so the last uh, tutorial able you to um, open this project um, if you watch the video then um, for example it let's uh, create transaction here breakfast then drinks okay this one then soup uh, this one chicken okay corn chowder um okay 350 then let's um pay click this one then 400 for example then payment dine in then select table uh five then click this payment are you sure to record as this as payment yes so we have um three items here menu then let's uh view sales so uh, the invoice is one point uh, one thirty five then three orders um, and there's there's a uh, this is a menu then they have three uh, menu in one order so I'm sorry guys uh, I'm I'm wrong to this so uh, okay so the 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 amount is three fifty, which is pesos. In your, uh, if you are lo located in the other country, then it will show your, um, your currency here, automatically if you are online. So click. So the total sales is, um, three fifty. For example, if we calculate all the transaction of user Java Aldrin from February so this is all the his uh, transaction which is page uh, there's a next page so 20,000 total is 20,951 so if you can in, uh, if you install just first of studio you can um, view this uh, source to my uh, just for just for file here uh, you can you can see in the source which is src main resources then reports folder then you can found uh, you found um, user sales here and then you can edit then you can uh, view the code then let's uh, the last part is 
um, you cannot open this if you ca you cannot uh, watch the entire video okay so change this then change password then let's change it admin um, the old password password is admin then this is green then uh, let's put um, uh, uh, change it user okay user so if we add user one then confirm uh, error confirm password so remove the one then you can see user if you want to open this uh, project uh, log in it user because I will change it to user so if you watch this video you can open this uh, project so save yes then let's try to log out then log in then admin the username then the password is user okay then enter then um, it will open so let's log out yes then log in admin then user okay so enable the button so thank you guys for watching see you next uh, video bye bye I hope you will subscribe. Thank you. Bye-bye. <laughs>